Hi, this is the third video on the Calvin Mears YouTube page, and we thought we would use this video to talk about whale anatomy, right whale anatomy. So I'm going to use this one seventh model of a whale named Calvin to show you all the characteristics that right whales have. So first of all, whales are mammals and they breathe air. Lungs, like you and me. They tend to hold their breath for about 12 minutes, but they can hold their breath longer if they have <laughs> When a right whale comes out of the water, you will see a V-shaped spout of water mist. Right whales are the only whales to make a V-shaped spout. So that is a pretty easy way to identify right whales when you're out looking for them. They do this because they have two blowholes instead of just one. Baleen looks like this and is made out of the same material as your fingernails and hair, called keratin. Um, baleen whales skim the top of the water to collect large mouthfuls of seawater and copepods. The whales will use their tongue to push the water through the baleen, but because the baleen works like a strainer, the copepods will stay in the whale's mouth. Right whales eat over 2,000 pounds of copepods a day. Wow. These white things you can see here, kind of along the top, and here, and here, and here, okay, are called callosities. Callosities are like a fingerprint to a whale. Every whale has a different callosity pattern. Scientists use this to tell different whales apart. The callosities are made up of little crab things called cyamids that cling onto rough patches on the whale's skin. This is a picture of the cyamids. It's kind of blurry. Sorry. Baby right whales are born without callosities and develop them later in life. When a whale has orange callosities, it means they have an infected wound. If you look at the skeleton of a right whale, you can see that, that it's strangely like a human's. The bones in the pectoral fins, these ones here, are actually like the bones in a human's fingers. Individual bones match up to those in a person's hand. So, yeah, this is a one-seventh model of right whale named Calvin. A real right whale is about as long as a school bus and can weigh up to 63.5 metric tons. That's 139,700 pounds. A lot of that is made up of blubber. Blubber is basically fat that helps keep the right whale's temperature controlled. You'll notice that on all of these Right whales, there is no dorsal fin, which is a fin goes like that. On Made the off back. the back of the whale. Um, like killer whales and sharks have that big fin coming off their back, but right whales do not. So this is an orca and a shark, and this is a right whale. They don't have any dorsal fin, you can see. Yeah, so that's another way that you can identify them. So, yeah, that's really all we have to say about this. Um... So, yeah, that's it for this video. Um, watch our other videos and respond. Um, Tell us can, how we can make them better, because it's kind of a work in progress. Um, you can comment, or you can email us, or something like that. And we'd love to hear from you. Thanks. Check out our Tumblr page. Bye. Bye.